In this video, I'm going to teach you how to use PlayStation 4 VR on PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. You can easily set up and use your PlayStation VR headset on a PC. To do this, you will need to download one specific piece of software, and also you need to establish the connections here. So usually, these two cables will be plugged directly into the VR headset itself. So this is the processing unit for your PlayStation VR kit. And now you can plug the HDMI cable here from PlayStation 4 into your PC alongside the USB cable. So plug both of these cables into your PC. And of course, this one here will go to power. So you just grab the power adapter and plug it into any outlet. Once you have the processing unit here receiving power, you have the HDMI cable and the USB cable connected to your PC, and the headset has been connected properly, it will be good to go. In order to ensure that it works as a standard VR headset on your PC, you will need to download this tool, Ivory Driver for Steam VR. So, of course, download Steam VR to begin with. This is going to be a standard tool from Valve, so you just download it for free, and then you can download Ivory. You will notice that while Ivory is free to download, they will only give you a light edition of PlayStation VR, so you will need to purchase the PSVR Premium Edition. This light edition will allow you to use it temporarily, so you can see how it works and how it feels. If you are satisfied, buy the full premium version afterwards. And as you can see, they even have a diagram of how it should be set up here, according to what I explained. So you plug the headset into the processing unit, the USB cable and the HDMI cable into your PC, and then plug it into power. With all of this done, you are good to go. Now you can use your PlayStation VR as long as you have this tool running in the background. So it will look like this. Steam VR will be it automatically started once you run Ivory, and you can configure all of these options related to Ivory PlayStation VR running on your PC. So I hope I was able to help you. If this video helped you, please consider subscribing. As you can see, according to our channel metrics, 83% of the people watching our videos are not subscribed. By subscribing, you can help us make higher quality videos. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.